her, please. Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please. I'm begging. I'm literally begging. Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging you, please. Please. That is not a crime, and you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So, no, he's not in the building? I don't know. I'm not. What do you know? I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. Spit in my face. Today's video takes us to Durham, Ontario, Canada, where this is part three of a video that a frauditor uploaded where he got his camera clocked. Now, the best part of this video is that the police do nothing. Stick around and see. You'll enjoy it. Yeah, but in the meantime, let's all sit back, watch, have a good laugh, and most of all, <laughs> enjoy! All right, this Yahoo uploaded in three parts. I cut it to two, and I'm going to give you a quick recap of what happened yesterday, and then we'll get into today's video. Roll that clip. No, you don't have permission to film me. You don't have permission to film me. I wouldn't touch me if I were you. I'm not touching you. I'm asking you what you're. What are you doing? What does you it look like? You have a mask on, mm -hmm. and you're My daughter works in there. You're making oh, me feel very uncomfortable. Excuse me. You don't have the right to film me. Cops are just here, dude. I know. She's 18. She's really uncomfortable. Who gives a shit? I'm yeah. getting your license plate. Get my, Get my license plate. Two, two wheel moto. Yeah. Yeah, back up, dude. Yeah. No, I don't need to back up. You're in, space. You're in public are you space, too, right? My you just you did that to his car. Yeah, right? I did it to his car. Yeah? Yeah. I got you, too, bud. Yeah, and that was live. Yeah, that's live. All right, so that's what happened in part one and part two. Now let's go ahead and jump to part three when the police arrive. Let's roll that clip. Well, unfortunately, with in the public, like he is in his rights to, to film. I know it makes people feel uncomfortable. What he wears she's is a minor. No, she's not. You said she's 18 years old. Don't Sir, lie. I, I, no, I, I'm, ca I'm going to interject in lies because she also said okay. I death threatened her this is when I said I get. You did. You just told me you were coming after me. So your business. Don't engage her. After your business. Two, two wheel motor company. A small family owned business. Owned by me. Can you grab it? Do you have your idea? And for, for court reasons, when I take their company, I'm going to need this. And make sure your body camera is rolling. I don't have a body camera. You don't have a body camera on. Good job. Yeah. So are you, you scrawny little. All right. We don't need to be watching insults. Just so funny. Man, just wait in your car. Again, this is watch it, dude. Watch it. Watch it. My wife like that. I don't care about your cameras. I don't care. Cops. Sir. Oh yeah. Is there any way you can go stand over there while I talk? No. You know what? I want to listen to his bullshit lies. I have every right to do so. Seeing as you don't have a body cam on, sir, that's that's messed up. Is it? A person who knows nothing about frauditors would watch this and think that this idiot pictured here is trying to get into some kind of physical altercation. You don't talk about another man's wife like that. What the hell is wrong with you, frauditor? You think the cops will save you? I bet that guy could get in some good licks before the cops broke it up. Yeah, you guys have body cameras. I know all of do you have do. Body cameras. Why, don't you have Why don't you have it on? Why don't you have it on? Because I don't have one. No transparency, eh? That's good. So that's why I'm here, sir. My new company hat. <laughs> so your, your daughter's 18, sir? She called me over there and was concerned about the town. Just, yeah, he said. That was good, sir. So where you pulled it over there and you the brought it on the street. And then what happened? Yeah, now you're married. I asked, no. Yeah, I told him my daughter was 18. They yeah. filmed her. She feels uncomfortable. She called me. That's why I'm here. Can you please stop? You have some choice words. He kind of came up in my face. I hate your camera. Your phone. Your tough line. I tried to find this man's company in Durham, Ontario, Canada, and I wasn't successful. 
Maybe somebody out there has better searching skills than I do. So we can contact this man and let him know where this video is so he can have it removed. Oh yeah, because that really pisses a frauditor off. Because when YouTube removes a video, all the money you made goes with it. Oh yeah, that's a shame, isn't it? He picked it up. There was no choice words. You didn't ask me to do anything. You came up and there was one of your first moves was to hit, no. try and hit me and he hit my phone. Okay, do you have footage of this? Oh, absolutely. It's Let's on live. See. It's on live right now. Okay. Oh, I can't show it to you live. Do you have a... I can send it to you later. I already told you okay. that. I'm not stopping the recording. There's too many people threatening me right now. Okay, well, there's indication that you threatened to stab this man with a pen. 100% tired of people touching my stuff, thinking they can get away with it thinking that because I'm filming somebody that they can put hands on. I've had enough. I've had enough of it. It happens way too often. And they called the cops, guys. I didn't even call the cops. They hit my truck. Oh, man. No way. Couldn't get much closer, eh? Try me. Sir, you're a pedophile. Oh, he's being, he's trying to intimidate me. He's trying to stab me with a pen. Oh, I took it out in case you attacked me. I got my hands in my pockets. Yeah. Now, apparently the two people who were attacked by this moron frauditor called some of their friends and a few people they work with. And that's who this guy is. I think he's a friend of the family or it could be the guy's brother. I don't know. It seemed pretty close. And uh, he's not taking any crap from the frauditor. Now the frauditor feels threatened. He's not his usual jovial self like he usually is. Of course, the police are there, and that makes him feel like a tough guy. Doesn't mean anything. If you're not involved, sir, are you, are you, this isn't just helping the situation at all. You're free to stand here. You're free to stand here, so is he, but obviously we got to be adults about this too, right? Well, seriously? So, I'm here to deal with one thing. I don't want to deal with like seven things today. I She's still saying I'm threatening. The Karen. See? Guy, you're bumping into me? This Get this guy the fuck away from me. This guy's bumping you're standing right in front of him. Like, you're trying to... No, he made an advancement. Go away. Sir? Do you see the pen? I, yeah. The pen is a reporter. I don't understand what your role is here right now, sir. Uh, free, free space, space right? Antagonize this gentleman. Free space, right? See, are you, what's your objective here? Are you trying to work this guy up or what? I'm not trying to do anything. He's trying to... I'm living in my free space. Okay. I like this guy on the right side. He said, I'm living in my free space. I'm not doing anything. We need more people like this to stand up to fraud and there's no doubt about it. That is great, isn't it? more problems not at all it's exactly not what you're all. doing okay. not at all all right i'm um, free space just like this gentleman here okay well i'm conducting an investigation right now so i just want to make sure that you're not going to get in the way of that or stop i'm not that doing well. anything he's the okay. one with the weapon it's not a weapon it's a, it's a camera it's a right. stabbable item anything right. is keys you name it buddy i'm allowed if anybody attacks you you're absolutely straight i'm allowed Anybody on the live, get this guy's name. We know lots of people in Pigger, right? Let's try this guy too. That is kid. And then that would be the wife over there, I'm pretty sure. Ooh, we frauded her. Good thing the cops are there, because you're outnumbered about six to one. They would have had their way with you, and we would have loved to watch that. Too bad. Perhaps next time. Eleven minutes later. There's too many people threatening me right now. Okay, well, there's indication that you threatened to stab this man with a pen in the throat. I took it out because of self-defense, okay. without well, a doubt. You can't, you can't threaten somebody. Well, I never threatened anybody. He threatened he was going to hurt me. But you said that you have everything, all this on video, right? I might. I think I do. Okay, I may. So can you please check to see if that's there so I can... No, I'll send it to you later. No, I, I need to determine right now if there's, if you threatened to stab him with a pen or not. After being assaulted? Okay. 
I, I'm not dismissing that. This is this is a yes, you are. Issue. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. When when did I say that I'm dismissing? He that says you got a me? pen there. Who cares? Yep. I can use a pen. I can use a pen in self-defense. If somebody's attacking me, I can use a pen in self-defense. Okay, the first part of this investigation was the phone, right? It was assault. Yes. Well, it's actually... Are you telling me that if, if somebody attacks me and I have my pens to do my thing, and, and this, one's a, this one's a stylus for my phone, I had it in my hand, Right. and if somebody's running after me, no. you're telling me that I couldn't use it in self-defense? Yes, I could. I'm saying, and I'm not you giving you any video. You yourself. Violence doesn't solve anything, Frauditor, and you have not learned that in your 40 plus years. And just because your property was damaged doesn't give you a right to attack someone. That guy slapped your camera. He didn't slap you. If he had slapped you, that's an entirely different story. You have every right to defend yourself. Be that as it may, I still wouldn't recommend slapping somebody because they slapped you. An eye for an eye, the whole world will be blind and short. Time. But you can't threaten to stab somebody in the throat. I didn't threaten to stab somebody. Okay. He was threatening to hurt me. Okay. Well, and this I is said, "What's being indicated?" And there's video. Yeah. So we could we could go through the live. This go through the live by going through the video. Right what now. I did was perfectly lawful, and I'm not helping you with your investigation at that point. Okay. Because there's nothing illegal that I did. Okay. Nothing. Not one well, thing. I'm gonna even 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 saying that I will. If that did happen, if I said I'm going to use this in self-defense, that's to keep the asshole off me. Okay. And well, his wife was attacking me from the side, was looked like she was about to attack me. Okay. Yes, right, you're 100%. Richard, before you say anything if I, more, if, if I, hold on a second. Before you say anything more, I'm going to caution you because now I'm conducting a threatening investigation as well. Yeah, go okay? ahead. So you understand anything that you say can be written down and can be used in court. Without a doubt. Do you understand that? Yep. And you're not obliged to say anything, okay? Yeah. And you can also I'm not call saying anything. If you like as well. But what I said, okay, I'm, says, just, I'm not do doing anything that? illegal here. Okay. Do you understand that? I understand. Because I want to make sure that anything else that you say afterwards, that you're fully aware. This is why you step a body camera, like your friend here. Investigating the threatening that. They yeah. Oh, not to worry, officer. The lad's a YouTube law expert. He's been watching YouTube videos forever in the day. Yeah, he sure does have a big mouth, though, doesn't he? And not to mention the fact that he's a bird brain. Matter of fact, he's a babbling, blubbering buffoon of a bird brain. No doubt. Go so ahead. Threaten them with the pen. Go I'm ahead. not dismissing the, the mischief with the phone. I'm not concluded that investigation. Assault. It's not mischief. Have... It's called assault. Well, it's unwanted. Here. Unwanted contact is called assault. You, you really need to learn a little longer uh, laws. Even you, putting somebody in fear for their life is called Do you remember the assault. part where I asked if it was in your hand? You remember that part, right? What, the phone? Yes. No, it wasn't in my hand. Okay, but that's the question, because if it was in your hand, it would be an assault. If it's not in your hand and it's there... Do you know that assault constitutes putting somebody in fear for their safety? That's what assault is. In fear for their safety. So he took a swing so, at me. Any video in there? Or Now look, Frauditor, the officer just tried to explain to you that it's not assault. And you still want to stand there and argue and talk about you were in fear for your life? If you had been in fear for your life, I would have just ran. I would have even picked up my camera. I would have left it there on the ground and I would have vacated the area. You were in fear, all right. You were in fear you weren't going to get your video footage for your upload. Isn't that right, Frauditor? A few minutes later... Um, so Richard, you can email that to me, the, the video in its entirety, like not an excerpt, the entire video. Yep. I can. So you said you had an hour and 56, would you be able to send the entire thing or? I don't know how that, you send me an email. Okay, we can do an evidence.com. Do an uh, evidence thing. Upload as well. Yep. So we can do it by that, because I'd like to see that whole thing. Obviously there's, like I mentioned to you, there's allegations of a, of a threat with, with a pen, and we didn't see that portion on your, on your phone. I yep. asked you to see the video of it, and you said that you don't want to play it back right now. That's right. That you want to send it, but you're, you're willing to send this to myself. Is that correct? Oh, I'd be talking to a lawyer before I do. Yeah, well, which, yeah. I told you before, you're well. Oh, yeah. Right to do, yeah, right? absolutely. I know that. Okay. I find it pretty absurd that you would even consider that as a threat. Okay. Would, well, okay, in that situation, let's say that did happen. Yeah. Let's say I actually had, let's say I had a knife on me, and a guy came up and started assaulting me on I'm this side. I'm going to continue this No, no, I, I want, I want to ask I'm you a question. Right You're not doing hypotheticals, right? I have enough on my plate right now. Yeah. I don't, I don't have time sure thing. Oh, dearie me, the frauditor's not getting his own way. 
He can't run the narrative today. Oh, that is a shame, Frauditor. You're being roasted by the cops, huh? Sweet thing. So these guys don't know shit about assault laws, apparently. So assault in Canada, guys. Assault in Canada is if uh, if you're in fear for your your safety or your life, it turns yeah, into an assault. That, right? I think for a good thing to have. So, yeah. um, what we've done here for a resolution is there's going to be a caution issue to both of you folks for the respective offenses. Okay. So there's an indication that you threatened to stab him with a pen in the throat. Um, obviously, with self-defense. Uh, one can defend themselves to a point that is reasonably necessary. Indicating that you're going to stab somebody in the throat is, in the circumstances I saw on video, not reasonable or necessary. So he has been um, obviously cautioned you for the threatening uh, of bodily harm and with your weapon being a pen, because a pen can be a weapon. So there will be a can be a that. weapon. <laughs> also, this gentleman has been cautioned for swatting your phone out, which constitutes uh, a mischief. I don't know what this jackass is laughing at. In close quarters, a tightly clutched pen or pencil can be a devastating weapon. What the hell's wrong with this guy? You can tell he never took any self-defense classes. He's just a punk out there with a camera, like the rest of them. Um, I see, obviously that would be an phone. assault, as far as I understand, but yeah. we'll talk about that later. If the phone is in your hand, sir, and he swatted it out, I would agree that that would be an assault when it's on. Your device is same as someone coming up and swatting the mirror of my vehicle and if it caused damage, it would be a, a mischief if I'm getting out of it, right? But if you were holding the mirror, if you were holding a mirror or you were holding a camera and somebody swatted the camera out of your hand without touching you, that is assault. Because that puts you in fear for your own safety, right? And then the guy continues with the I will go to prison, which indicates what? What would you think that indicates? That means I will kick the shit out of you and I will do time for it and it will be fine. Richard, but that, you know, but putting you know, someone in fear for their safety is considered assault in this country. I will be talking to the uh, di uh, the Ministry of the Attorney General about yep. this, yep. but you guys need a little better training on what is actual assault. Swatting this out of my phone case, out of the, okay. is, is considered assault. So we'll get back to the- It's unwanted contact. It's so unwanted contact. He is now I forgot, Frauditor, you're doing this for what reasons? Oh, that's right, apparently in Canada you have to fight for your freedom. Similar to what we have to do here in America, we have to fight for our freedom. Because remember, if you don't use it, you lose it! I think you've already lost it, Frauditor. I've been asked to have no contact with yourself. Um, I advise them that obviously you are out in the public and if he sees you to not engage, I would also ask the same of you. Yep. If you see this individual again, this gentleman, please do not engage. If he approaches you or things get out of hand, please call us before that happens. Okay? Yep. And obviously- Well, you see how fast it can go out of control. I, I've been it, doing, goes, it goes pretty fast, man. I've been doing this job a long time and I've seen things get way out of hand. Uh, thankfully, things didn't escalate to the max today, uh, but also- And you know why he brought the big group here, right? You know, you know why the big group of people is here. No, they're not. going to be assault. They're going to try to assault me or try to follow me to assault me. No, if, if after they do here. that, then you call 911. Uh, and you and have that two guy. On you. Huh? You call 911. You have the ability to call 911, right? Oh yeah. So you call us immediately if you feel that they're following you or going to harm you in any way. Yep. Okay. That doesn't change. And, and following me around the parking lot. That's, there's another thing. He was doing it with the intent of causing alarm, and that is now considered criminal harassment. Well, good people, we're going to leave it right there for today. The video continues for another five minutes, and the officer's trying to talk some common sense to the frauditor. But, ah, you know, common sense does not exist among frauditors. So, hey, what can I tell you? The lad lost, but he'll be filing a lawsuit. Oh, I'm sure he will be. He's probably going to go after this poor man's company. We gotta find out where he works and warn him about this video. But at any rate, if you enjoy watching stupid people do stupid things on my channel like this Yahoo from Canada, please subscribe. I wonder what's wrong with that lad. Maybe his mama dropped him on his head as a child. I don't know. Hey, by the way, good people, check out Dr. Dave's Facebook page, Dr. Dave the Debunker of Frauditors. Over there, you'll find Rusty Boy. Goat Boy, Looney Lana, and Zany Zack, among others. Oh, it's a really good time over there. 
By the way, Frauditor from Canada, get a real job and stop all this nonsense. Choose to that. What's his name? What's his name? I want his name. I want, hey, don't leave because you're detained, bro. What do you think about your service here today, ma'am? You know what? If you're gonna be such a jerk. He was no being better. disorderly. He was no being better. disorderly. And we're not breaking the law. We shouldn't have a problem here, right? Oh. No. Yo, you're racist. Kate racist. Oh, that's a hate crime. You're being disorderly. Uh, call the police. Call the police. Call the police. Don't worry, your voice. You're being. You're, you're getting aggressive. No. If we're in public property, you have to have a, a crime in order to trespass us. Sir, take your hands out of your pocket. I'm asking for a law. We don't know what the heck you're gonna do right now. Sir, we're not doing anything wrong. What's the third amendment? Let me go talk to him. Yeah, nobody knows the damn third amendment. This guy's being disorderly, but it's okay because he's a cop. Get away from me. Get away from me. But but you can cite date them. Yeah. Are they going to be cited for disorderly conduct? In America, the land of the free, where we choose to do what we want as long as we don't break the law, who the hell do you think you are? Fucking man, dude. I'm not doing anything to you. You're a bitch ass punk. I'm not doing anything to you. I'm not doing anything on you. Freedom of speech, he never said fighting words. Those are fighting words. How is that fighting words? If you feel like fighting, it's your problem. He's not doing anything wrong. I can guarantee you, sir, I can take a video of myself farting. And thousands will see it. Dude, you're in my space. Okay. Get away from me. Call the police, would you please? Just know that we are the bosses, bro. We are. You're, you're not. You have a gun? Yeah. It's your second amendment. Guess what? I have a camera. We're going to speak to the mayor about this. By the way, sir, you're in Auditing America with over 100 million views on the internet. I don't have to discuss my day with you. Who are you? Can you uh, briefly in one sentence tell us what the third amendment is? You don't point your finger at people. We weren't harassing anyone. Oh, you assaulted me. I did. You assaulted She assaulted me. Come on, we're on Fuck camera. You. We're Fuck on you. camera. Smack me, okay? We're talking about violence. Come on, man. We're talking about violence. Hey, hey, hey. Get out of my face. Hey. Get out of my face. I'm not backing up. No, you ask me. I'm not. If you touch her, you're gonna go to jail. I'm not touching her. Get back up. I don't want to touch you. Back up. Oh, the shit show at the post office. You should be crying about that line that you're making. Why are you crying about cameras? I have an anxiety problem. What's your name? I don't answer questions. And that is why, my friends. Mr. America does what he does. And then you become a tyrant. And we right? can nicely if, if refuse. I'm a tyrant. Who are you? Who are you? You're sitting here recording people without their permission. I'm a camera guy. And I'm in a public place. What's your problem, bro? I'm my own boss. I'm my own boss. I'm my own boss. If I take the mask and face, then you call yourself? What you gonna, I, I, I bet you don't have the boss to do that. We have other I don't here. wanna be on your camera. Well, maybe being in a public How place about common courtesy? Now it's your turn to walk away. I'm, I can walk away whenever I'm, uh, I you really- walk away now. Am I, I'm, am I being detained? I just told you okay, I'm free to leave. Oh, okay, I'm free to leave. So go ahead. Yes, please. Oh, okay, I'm free to stay too. Listen, bro, slow your roll. You have an appointment. I'm not talking to you. Uh, what the Third Amendment is, and I'll be on my way. You don't have to tell me verbatim. You can just tell me briefly what's the Third Amendment about. Why did you do you that? We asked show. you multiple times. Okay, but you, why did you do that? I don't need to speak with you, sir. Who do you need to speak with? Get away from me. I'm not doing anything. Wrong. You're too close, bro. I'll never break the law. I know. I know my boundaries. I know where I'm at. I'm not interfering with anybody. I don't need you guys to explain to me how to behave myself. Take this one more personal, because I've been in there and I know exactly what you guys do. I know exactly how you guys treat the inmates. Don't, uh, don't, 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 you don't touch me. Don't you ever touch me again. All right. Keep your hands to yourself. Why are you touching me, bro? You are, you are a Nazi, sir. And we can get you fired. You know that? Traveling, we can ask you, to you don't. You can ask, but I can, I can nicely refuse if I'm engaged in a constitutionally protected activity. Hey, man, but you have a gun and I want you to yeah. stay away from me. Before you enter those doors, all of you stick your tongue in your asses. You touch me. You touch me. Why you put your hands okay, on me? Why, why you put your hands on me though? Oh, you, no, you you hit me. You can't go anywhere. Look at this guy is following me. Leave me alone. She hit me. She hit me. It's, it's on video. She hit me. And now she's detained by the police. Have freedom of speech. You don't tell me what to do. Who do you think you are? Let's stay right here. No, you can't. You're escaping. Yeah, you're helping a criminal. That's a crime too. You were all up in my face. Why don't you get in my face again, stupid? I'm sick of you. I don't think there's a crime that's been committed. Well, you haven't, you haven't, you haven't, you haven't made an investigation. <laughs> okay, well, uh, did he assault you? What are you going to arrest me for? Trespassing? What's the crime? Right, you need a crime, you need a crime to trespass somebody in a public place. What's the crime? Sir, I tried to explain What's the crime? Clearly you just want to argue. Well, no, I, of course, I want to argue. I've been, I've been 
violated right now. The first one. You're required to What's know the this. First one? I'm asking you. What's the first one? I'm asking you, sir. What's the first one? I'm, what you tell me? I'm asking you. No, I'm asking you, sir. Okay. You don't give us orders. Why don't you understand about that?